गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट फिस्टूला इन एनो इन टर्म्स ऑफ गुड सेल्स रूल बेसिकली गुड सेल्स रूल गुड सेल्स लॉ टेल एस टू नो अबाउट द शेप ऑफ फिस्टूलस ट्रैक शेप ऑफ फिस्टूलस ट्रैक मीन्स वेदर फिस्टूलस ट्रैक इज स्ट्रेट और खर्विलीनियर सो बाय दिस डायग्राम I would like to explain how fistulous tract is formed in case of fistula in ano. So, if patient comes to you during parenteral examination when you are keeping your patient in left rectal position or the sims position, just divide. Suppose this is the anal canal, circumference of the anal canal. This is the circular circumference of the anal canal. All right. So, after imagine this uh, circular line of the anal canal now draw one imaginary horizontal line like this so after drawing this imaginary horizontal line this whole circumference periphery of anal canal now will divided into two half anterior half and posterior half so now after dividing the anal canal into anterior half and posterior half the next point is locate the external opening as already we are knowing that to say fistula in ano always there is two opening one is external opening and second one is the internal opening so external opening is visible over the buttock or towards the scrotum or towards the um, sacrum side so suppose this is the external opening which is situated anterior to this imaginary horizontal line so if external opening is situated anterior to this imaginary horizontal line then as per good cells law the track will be straight and this will open here inside the anal canal all right but on the other hand if external opening is situated post anterior to this imaginary horizontal line then this track is not going to a straight like this one but here the fistula track will follow the path as a curvilinear path or horseshoe shaped like path like this and all these fistula track is going to open in the posterior midline by a common fistula track and following the shape of curvilinear or horse shoe shaped path now exception to this uh, rule is that if external opening is situated more than 3 cm more than 3 cm in terms of more than 3 cm away from the anal verge in that situation irrespective of its location whether it is situated in the anterior half or the posterior half it will always follow the concept of external opening which is situated in the posterior half that means our fistula track will be curvilinear in shape you can appreciate here if external opening is situated more away from the anal verge then it is not going to be a straight even it is situated in the anterior half of this imaginary horizontal line it is it is follows as curvilinear line or horse shoe separate like a structure so this is the good sense law in summary i would like to conclude with that to tell the shape of fistula track good sales role is very very important and to understand the good sales law first draw an imaginary horizontal line to divide the anal canal into anterior half and the posterior half now find out the site of external opening if it is situated in the anterior to this imaginary horizontal line then the fistula track would be straight but if it is situated posterior to this imaginary horizontal line then the track is not going to be a straight but it follows the path as a curvilinear path an exception to this rule is that if external opening is situated more than 3 cm away from the anal bar then it follow as a curvilinear not a straight even it is situated in the anterior part or anterior to this imaginary horizontal line thank you